Yo guys, how we doing? I'm back. It's been Christmas, it's been New Year. I know I've had an upload in about two weeks, but with all the festivities and stuff, uh, I just couldn't get an upload done. And also, I've had a seriously bad chest infection, and I wasn't able to make a video because I was just like fits of coughing. It was an utter nightmare. Just before we start this recording, guys, I just want to say big congrats to Craig Dancy. He was the winner of the Turtle Beach Air Force 50Ps. Uh, they're on his, their way to him just now, he's informed by DM and also on Twitter, so big congrats mate. Unlucky if you entered and you didn't win, but don't forget I will be running more giveaways and more competitions, so stay tuned to find out what I'm giving away next. So like I said, we're going to play Leo Zafia, I got this, uh, it's a double pack, it is the original game and the Inheritance DLC, uh, but we'll get through the original game first and then we'll whack on the Inheritance DLC if it's any good. Something's telling me it is going to be good. A lot of people have said this is amazing. So let's just jump right in uh, and scare the shit out of ourselves. Let's go. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. Ah, here we go, big Victorian scary spooky mansion. What the fuck? Okay. Dear sir, we would like to ask you to cease spoiling our pest control pit specialist. Right, anyway. What is this? Okay. Clearly not happy with that person. Sir, I didn't touch the workshop, just like you asked, although I can imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Fuck you too, man. Fuck you too. Nope! We ain't going in that basement yet. Where's this? What? I can't even read that. Longlead Muggle Avenue 7C. Pop what? Pop. Popu. Popu. Pop Q. Fuck knows what that says, but it says po fucking Popeye or something. <laughs> the keychain. Hello. Ha ha ha. I don't know why I put in a French accent on when I'm in the kitchen there. That's a wee bit stereotypical. So far, we have came across nothing of use, nothing of scariness. Um, I'm I'm not digging this so far. This is not impressing me at all. Okay, let's go to this kitchen. But I'm looking at like a pure pimp limp. Check that out. Sup. So what? Somebody's flooded my fucking bathroom, man. Turn the tap off. Jesus. Yeah, uh, prosthetics. Below knee prosthesis. Oh, okay. So, I take it the pimp limp is because we've got a fake leg. So, so far, all we've worked out is it's hard to open doors. And we've got a fucking a peg leg. Um, is there a light switch? What the fuck? What the fuck? Is there a light switch in here, man? Turn that on. Mouse trap. Oh my god, man! I crap myself here. We've literally just triggered mouse traps. A whole bunch of them. Um, let's head upstairs. We'll head upstairs first. See what's up here. What the fuck was that? Did that door just open? The ladder just fell. What? Is that smashed? Is that a bottle of wine? Smashed bottles of wine? Okay. We found a key. Key to what I don't know, dear friend. Let me ask you some simple questions. You completely lost your goddamn mind. I know you're going through some hard times right now. I don't <laughs> Fuck. Okay, it wasn't me. I never done nothing. Be mucky all night. Don't wake me up. 
Wake it, wake it! Yeah, need these out. Oh, seven years bad luck. Oh, Galactic's grand opening in flames. Disastrous fire at the new department stories. Dozens fighting for their lives. Why do we not keep stuff? I hope I'm not meant to press a button or something and keep it in my inventory. And I'm just putting everything back. Because that would be a pain in the arse. The new face of music, A Night in the Opera, becomes A Night to Remember. Oh, we've got a lot of names or something scrubbed out here. Might not be a household name yet, but just given her time. Incredibly talented, multi-instrumental. Gave an astounding performance last night. Ah, uh, she was certainly astounding. Da, da, da. Like, clearly that must have been your love interest or something that's ended up playing the opera or something. That's locked. Whoa! Holy crap! I've just realised that's all wine bottles. This man is an alcoholic. Sorry I couldn't sleep. The legs been acting up again. Figured I might as do well some more. Uh, this must be me that wrote that because obviously I have a prosthetic leg. That's why I've got a pimp limp. What is this? It's a, it's a tea candle. That is a tea candle. Why am I trying to pick a tea candle up? How do you use the key? Right, obviously that key doesn't open that door. So we must head downstairs again. Unless this is a way here. What? Oh no man, no. What the fuck was that? This room looks fucked. There's noises coming from here. Dolls, no. I'm done, I'm done. Dolls and games are fucking... Spooky motherfuckers. Children's bedrooms. No, no. Usually some sort of demon down here. No, nope, turn the light on. Why turn the light off? Right, clearly this was... Probably... Your daughter's bedroom. Obviously there's been some sort of accident with your daughter and your wife or something. Okay, there's nothing really in there that's... Keep in my interest, so we'll shut that door. We'll head back downstairs. That is one ugly motherfucker. I realize there's only two rooms to try, right? I ain't gone in that basement yet, so... We'll try and get in here, right? I've got the key. Ah, that key opened this. Ah, see. Okay. There's a pure pigsty in here. Clearly, I don't clean a brush, I just shove them in a box. Has this man never heard a turpentine? This man's definitely an alcoholic. Jesus! Come on. How much wine do you drink? Right, let's see what's under here. That was anticlimactic, because there's nothing there. Oh, wait, there's a note. Lost, you deserve it, finish it. Um, okay. So, I guess we just exit this room. What? Was that the door I came in? Um. This is not where I left. It's getting spooky. Is that a window? Oh! <laughs> um, where did I go? Because the windy just slammed shut and I nearly had a fucking heart attack. Let's just go back out here. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, I see how this goes now. So, we go in a room, but yet yeah, when we go out the same door, we are transformed into some other place in the mansion. My god, this this is gonna be fun. Let's see what goodies we can find in here. Ah, there we go. Oh, for God's sake, man. Whoa. Whoa. Five, eight, four, four, eight, five. Oh, right. Four, eight, five. I may need to write that down somewhere because clearly that must... Be oh, it's probably this. Show whoa, hey, what the fuck is with the whispering? 
five. No, four. Eight. Five. Right, that was pretty simple. The pastel's back look closer. The thought oh my god, what the fuck? The most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. Right. So, so, will you marry me? That ring was in the room as well. There's another one of them in the room. Pretty sure I picked it up earlier. Right. The pastel's back. Take a closer look. Right, so I'm looking. Is there any wee clues on this, wee marks, nope, <coughs> no that I can see anyway, ah, oh, and a doorway's just appeared, saying never forget, right, okay, let's go in here, it's clearly going to lead to something exciting, a doorway just magically appears, oh my god man, what the hell, oh, I've just fell in a fucking, what? Oh no. That was a trap door? Oh no. Right, I've no fucking torch man, this is dark as shit in here. Light switch. There we go. Whoa! Yo, big spooky motherfucker. <laughs> it is getting spooky now, boys. And I ain't taking the time to read this man, my love, even though you have not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. This must be a note to your unborn daughter. Let's head out. Because that motherfucker spooked the shit right out of me two seconds ago. This must be how you get out. Yep. So, he's went through there. Oh my god, that motherfucker has replaced him. Because that was there a minute ago and that's how I fell down. And now he's up there. Right, we need to go back out this door. And this has probably changed to a whole different area. Fucking told you! Right, so who's these chaps? Ah! It's like two paintings in one. Bunch of two-faced people. Oh! Paint deep wise. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> you see the motherfucker? Okay. <laughs> oh my god, man. What the fuck is doing this? I was like, this house is possessed or something. <laughs> oh no. I don't like me here crying. Especially when there's whispering. What's that all about? Wait, wait, wait. What's that, what's that all about? What's this? Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Okay. A lot of unanswered questions so far. I don't know who this woman is. Was it your wife? Was it just somebody you stalked? Are you a creepy man stalking weirdo? What is the, the backstory to this? That looks fucked. There's two doors here, wait, I'm gonna try this one first. See if this opens. I hate when you get too much choice, right, that's good. Because I literally hate when you get too much choice and you're like, did I go this door, did I go that door, where did I go? First step is the hardest. Okay. Oh, we're in the kitchen again. I don't know how that worked, but we're in the kitchen again. What the fuck was that? What is... what is happening? Huh? Oh! What door was that? Somebody's bashing the door in. I'm in 
Okay, yo! Fuck! Right, okay, okay, okay! Okay, I get the script, I get the script. You're not happy, somebody's not happy with something. This is great. Oh! This I do not like this. What first you can actually take something I'd like a love fucking for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I that had is to a find a skin. knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So that is I a skin. used a razor, Holy in fact. Fuck. And then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hand steady. Okay, so we're pretty much cemented the fact that you are a fucking madman. Right, pretty much the only way you can go is this way. Ah, uh, and we're in the painting room. Ah, uh, what the fuck? Shapeless dreams. I take it this must be like, when you complete a level, you kind of draw on this. It looks like seriously zombified fucking flamingos. Ah, uh, this there must be like wet one six. There must be six sort of pieces you find in puzzles or something. So we found the first one. Ah, an old style elevator. Sweet. Okay, just miraculously opened. Okay. This puts a lot of faith in this fucking room. Filled with scary paintings. Okay, something bad is going to happen in here. There's a key. Okay, we've well, changed fucking position again. What the fuck was that? I'm telling you, that's no wind. That ain't wind. Oh! I'm done. I'm done. I told you man, dolls are spooky as fuck. Fucking mad possessed demon doll. Shit. We've got writing. What does this say? Um, it's, what? It's like fucking back to the front. It was locked. Oh! Just went through the mirror. Undone. 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 It cannot be undone. It cannot be undone. Oh my god, look at that. It's fucking wrecked. Hey, what the hell? Why is that all blurry up there? Okay. You can hear paintings now. This man is a fucking psychopath. Ooh. Right, definitely. Your daughter must have perished in that fire or something because he seems to be fixating a lot on fire. Oh, what's this? Good boy. Honey, remember how you said it would be nice to have a cat so the baby could have someone to play with? Well, I just bought us a dog. <laughs> oh. Maybe your dog perished as well. What? Okay. There's just a painting blocking the fucking way. Do I take it we walk through this or something? Nope. Okay, so we... 
what the fuck this game <laughs> this game throws fuck right out you man oh my god right there's a smaller version here what am I meant to do? I'm trapped in this fucking room. Oh! Oh my fucking... I'm sick. Sick of this game. Fucking trolling the shit with me, man. Uh. Fucking hell, man. Okay, I'll leave, I'll leave, I'm gone. Don't try and fucking decapitate me with a fucking fan. Don't see nothing there. Oh there, oh there's a key. Oh. Hey, 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 what the fuck is happening? What is happening? What, what, what? What is that fucking noise? Whoa! Fucking pass off. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. What the fuck? And I'm supposed to go out there now. After that, I'm supposed to go out here. What? So, like, whatever the fuck is chasing you is meant to be part of your painting? I hope that's gone the other way and went to this fucking room. This looks like the bedroom again. Looks like we might need to play this. Uh, oh my god man, are you serious? I actually need to wind this up. Oh. Oh. Oh shit. Oh my god. Is it fucking Ben Melton? Everything's Melton? Or is that meant to represent I needed fire a damage jar or something? and a plastic tubing. I siphoned gas before. I knew how it was done. I stuck the tube in a vein and sucked on it until blood filled my mouth. Then put the tube what? in the jar and it just kept coming. The taste of copper haunted me the entire night. Why didn't I think of a syringe? Okay. So we've got skin and blood. And this, that, uh, maybe this is meant to represent fire damage or something. But it looks fucking melted. Right, how do I leave? How do I fucking leave this room? Maybe I need to turn this again. Right, there's a wee switch on the back there. I don't know if that'll do anything. Hopefully that switches it back to reverse mode or something. There we go. Yes, that is it. Reverses everything. Go to it at last. There's just a wee switch here right on the back, right there. Now we can go out of this fucking room. Thank God for that. Ah, oh, looks like we've completed chapter two. Okay, let's let's add to the painting. So we've changed the fucked up pink flamingos to I 
I have no clue what the fuck that is. That is just generally a, a mess. That is that is that is terrible. That's a drunken mess. Anyway, guys, that is it for the first episode of Layers of Fear. You really need to be into these kind of games. These games are kind of you go about the mansion, you sort of try and find clues and stuff. Uh, might be a wee bit boring for some people, but as you've seen there, there was a lot more scares coming towards the end. Uh, and it's just going to keep on coming and coming and getting worse. So check back for episode 2. Episode 2 should be a wee bit less boring. Uh, so that kind of the start of the game, it kind of goes a wee bit slow. But I've heard that it gets a lot more intense as it goes on. So check back for episode 2. Don't let this one discourage you if you're watching episode 2. Check back for that one. Uh, next video is probably going to be a Gear VR video. Uh, I've had a lot of support on that, on that side of things, the VR side of things. We get a lot of love. I think my facial fears video is almost at twelve and a half thousand views. That is that is mental. That is incredible. Uh, the play with me gear VR game I just put up is hitting about three hundred odd. So they seem to be the more popular videos that I do. Uh, but I do enjoy doing these horror type games because they are awesome. But like I say, guys, that is it. I'm sorry for not uploading in about two weeks, but I was not well and it was Christmas and all the rest there. But uh, I'd just like to say again, thanks for the 260 subs. I hope we can keep growing at this rate. I'm probably going to do another giveaway at 500 subs. So stay tuned for that. Uh, and again, a big congrats to Craig Dancy. I hope you're enjoying that headset, pal. And I'll see you in the next one. I've been Pure Gamer. You guys have been awesome. Peace!